right way in a proper way that's what matters here you know and as well as solutions you know uh the reason why we have a lot of these charities we picked because they are going towards proper solutions in which we can make a better world for all of us not just for not, like nonsense uh and yeah i'm, I'm assuming fl flambo right you're you're talking about that 70 percent skill yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah i'm assuming he was talking about that oh <laughs> uh, yeah so no th uh this has been incredible wow everyone showing such love and support man i'm so happy to see this come from people oh yeah. my gosh is that what we're gonna have right now big d and and void and void oh, oh. <laughs> yo, yo 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 is this what's happening oh yes sir oh <laughs> that's what i need to see and I'm not trying to be greedy, but I'm like, hey, we have 5.5k. Can we can we see six? Are y'all are y'all y'all feeling up to it? I mean, you know, it's only 500 less than 500 even dollars away. I think I think we can do it, guys. I think. I mean, where are we right now? We're like, well, I don't even know where we are in bracket. Like loser semis, winners. I don't even, I don't even know. Like, winners finals. Where are we? I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna check the bracket for once. Because if uh, I'm gonna be can, honest with y'all, we can do it. We can do it. Come yeah, on. we're losers semis. I was right. I was right. Actually, no, I lied. I lied. I lied. Oh. We're, we're winners finals and loser semis. We're just doing winners finals first. Um, but yeah. Oh, oh, there we go. We got another five dollar donation from our buddy Kurt. That's what I like to see. Let's go. Oh, another dono. Ten dollars for SMC. I'll, I'll, I'll drop another two hundred, baby. Let's go, man. Let's move it, man. Oh. Let's move it, baby. You got the smoke. You got the smoke. Yes, yes, sir. We got the smoke. You hear that? We dropping them, bro. Let's, we let's dropping get it, them. Man. Let's can get it. Coming together for a good cause. But I also want to make sure everyone that's watching that, uh, you know, luckily for, for this, right, you know, Ryo Beep. You know prior to organizing all this stuff really did his research really made sure that you know all of the memorials and funds that this money is going to is like legitimate to actually helping the cause because there's so many others out there that that are being basically vultures to try to find a way to get free income just make sure that if you're scrolling on twitter and you see this gofundme or, or this link or whatever that it's just legitimate because I'll, I'll never forget like Coney 2012 and how the invisible children like robbed people of like millions of dollars. I'll never yeah. forget when when Haiti got hit with the earthquake and all this money that went to like it was like Red Cross. Just never like I went to Haiti like two years after the earthquake happened. We're still intense, bro. They they, they took that money and never explained what happened to it. So that's like the kind mm -hmm. of thing where you know you want to do the good thing and you think you're doing the good thing by donating to what you believe is good cause from people saying they're gonna give it to the right thing, but just make sure that you're being extra careful out there and that you do your homework and you make sure that it is what it actually is. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm like watching Void, I'm like, oof, oh, big deal. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, oh my, this is actually too good. This is, <laughs> this is actually way too good. Oh, the setup. Oh, here we go. Boy, are you going to get the separation? Are you get Bouncing Fish? Not going to get it. Oh, no. Big D, man. That's right, he got, he's going to squall hammer his way to victory. <laughs> hey. Yep. hey, I mean, that move is so good. I know. <laughs> so good. Even if they... It's so hard to punish. Yeah, oh. and I just freaking just dip. <laughs> got a phone call from Mom. I had to step out for a second. Yo, yo, absolutely, Mr. Shasta. Be, just be real with each other. If I can grow past a closed minded household, then you can too. Black Lives Matter. Let's go. <laughs> it said, oh, oh, nah, nah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is gone. Oh, beautiful forward smash punish there. Get up. I, I love the idea there. Though by the, he's trying to make sure that if like Boyd can run in, he would be able to use that like invincibility to just like go ahead and just kind of bust through. But Boyd saw that and get the punish. Boyd is moving so far, just trying to get some damage. Big D in a really good place here though to take the stock. I'm trying to get actually take the stock from that uh, Nana punish coming from Boyd. Let's see if he can get something here to set up on that shield. Man. <laughs> 
<laughs> so clean. Uh, Big D might have this one. Hold on, charging up the needle, spacing around. Okay, yeah. boy. He's trying to slow down. Oh no, the blizzard. Oh, oh, that's damage. That is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Kind of hurt. <laughs> Let me see, Robbie Beat put out another tweet. Yo, 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 go and retweet that right now. Top four, Louis Money, Best Ness, Void, and Big D with me and Bam holding it down on the microphone. Go ahead and retweet that. Try to get as many people in here as we can. We're in the last final stretches of this tournament, the last final stretches of this fundraiser. We want to make sure we go out with a bang. We're so close to 6,000 now. I don't even know. When the heck did we hit 5,800? Did I just miss something? I don't even know. Yeah. But dang, I need, I need more of that. I might be asking right. for 7K soon. If you keep, if you guys keep playing with me like that, you keep playing with me like that, I might ask for 7K, bro. Oh, <laughs> absolutely, man. Dang, man. Yeah, Fiddy's actually been going in. He's been playing absolutely incredible through the entirety of this tournament. Um, Shouts to... Was it Minoru? KR donated 20. Justice for Toyin, Salu, George Floyd, Brianna Taylor, the countless lives lost to systemic racism and police brutality. Black Lives Matter. Thank you. Yes, little Black Trans Lives Matter. Black Trans Lives Matter. Black Trans Lives Matter. Facts. 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 Facts, man. I, I can't say it enough, man. Black Trans Lives Matter. Black trans lives matter. Mm -hmm. Man, I gotta look at. I got the list, man. I got. I gotta see because it's just like there's so there's so many. You know, you get, oh, yeah. Philando Castile, Jonathan Farrell, Sandra Bland, Eric Garner, Freddie Gray, Tamir Rice, Breonna Taylor, George Floyd, Natasha McKenna, Ahmad Arbery, Oscar Grant. Sean Bell, Trayvon Martin, Christian Taylor, Kimani Gray, Kendrick McDade. And it's like, it's like, what, like, what, 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 what do we, what do we do? Right? You know, like, people always say, and this is, this is what, like, tilts me the most, I think, is when people say, like, oh, like, why are you, like, what? peacefully protest? So, like, why are you guys peacefully, like, why don't you just peacefully protest? And it's like, all right, well, First off, the majority of these protests are peaceful and get escalated by police. First yeah. off. Second off, it's like, okay, well, do you not think we've tried? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's like, okay, Colin Kaepernick decides to get on a knee, and everyone's like, oh, sh you know, go in and go throw a football. We didn't, we, we're here to watch the NFL, you know, yep. screw your kneeling shit. And then it's like, oh, it's like, shut up and dribble. And it's like, oh, okay. But then now that it's like more on a national scale, the same people that were like, shut up and dribble are like, oh, okay, you're entitled to an opinion. But I wasn't Absolutely. before. But I wasn't before. Yep. And one of my favorite, yep. favorite quotes is from Tupac, right? And I shared it on Twitter already, but it's like easily one of my favorites. He's talking about how like, uh, I, I don't even remember. It's like, it's like the food one where it's like, Hey, you know, you got some people, they're hungry, they're outside the door, they got mad food inside, they got more than enough food for everybody. And it's like, oh man, we're starving out here, bro, we just want some food. You know, y'all guys, you guys got the good food. We got, like, three-week expired Lunchables that we can't live off of. And, you know, it says, you know, day one, you're gonna go ahead, you're gonna go knock on the door, you're gonna be like, hey, excuse me, sir, can we get some food? We're really hungry out here, you know. Whatever is whatever, cool, you know. Uh, a month goes by and you at the door, you knocking, and now, now you singing like, "Hey, how you doing? Let me get some food, please." And then decades go by and you're like, "Pop, pop! Open up the door. It's real. I'm here to grab some food." Like you, you're tired. You tried the stuff that they recommend. You tried to keep it peaceful, mm -hmm. but then when it escalates to the point where it's not, you can't. You can't be acting surprised that people don't want to be peaceful anymore because when they're peaceful, it don't work. So why would they keep trying it? No, absolutely. You know, it, yeah, it, people, it don't make and, sense. Yep, and you got to recognize that people, like, are hurting. And you also need to recognize that a lot of looting also is being perpetrated by, like, 
supremacist group, some like anarchists just doing things, and there's like so many avenues in that. And so the idea of thinking that it's one and the same is terrible. But even then, if they're one and the same, it's like when people have been pushed in the corner and consistently happen in this way, like something wrong. And people are it's standing. It's funny because people are spending more time humanizing property than actual humans, and that's wild. Like, I love it because. Sony put out something, and Sony was like, oh, well, you know, like, they're talking about, like, Black Lives Matter, like, and that's, like, we need to get, uh, people need to be doing good, and we need to, like, get actual change. And someone said, like, Sony, hey, we know, like, on Twitter, they're like, Sony, we know you're upset about this and your property's damaged, and Sony just said, like, they replied that whoever is handling their, their Twitter right now is a, is a god, but they were just <laughs> like, they're like, you know what, like, hey like we have insurance for these things like that's going to be that's easily replaced like that life can't be replaced and the thing is like these companies have like multi multi million dollar insurance like they're not this is not like these companies aren't getting destroyed like they literally have things for this like that is easy for them to take care of a life you're not bringing them back that life right and that's what matters and like, oh man, yeah, Void actually just went super no. <laughs> ham right now. I, I just gotta say, yeah, Void went super ham. That was actually wild. The Pichu is here. I just want to make sure that we go back through these uh, donations, man. There are a lot of people giving. Um, I saw, Boy, I know we, we talked about. 6K? Yep. So, like, Best Nest, of course, we already know. He, 600. Black Lives Matter, let's go. Best Nest. J. David Lowe donated $100. Buddy Cart donated $5. SM. See, Craw donated $10. I wish I could give more. Hashtag Black Lives Matter. Hey, you give what you can give. That alone is amazing. We appreciate you. We know people are in hard times. Do what you can do. Uh, Bam Talks donated $200, whoever that guy is. Um, Bad <laughs> Smash uh, donated $50. Uh, Cat G donated $132. Donated 100 earlier. Let me help you reach 6 k That's what I'm talking about. Keep it up. GM Tosh donated 15. J. David Lowe donated again $100. Duck Duck Pony donated 20. J Dog donated 5. Thank you for participating, chat. Being a good ally is uncomfortable, but part of the challenge is remembering the boundaries of your compassion. You don't have to stop at the edge of your comfort zone. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. And Adam Aguchi again with the donation $5. Black Trans Lives Matter. Of course. Erica Zen fan donated $5. I love okay. that. Again, thank you all so much for supporting the movement, for the culture, supporting a human rights issue, to continuing to increase and grow your compassion. I love that. Even just being here, retweeting, sharing, engaging in conversation, you are doing something. You are a part of this. So we all appreciate you and man also you guys are getting incredible smash right now too so that's a pretty good deal to yeah i mean <laughs> i'm <laughs> big t and void are going at it right now i have like it looks like big t this time around is doing uh, doing a bit better against this uh pichu but man I i'm very intriguing to see how this matchup is really going to go like theoretically i feel like it it would be so insane for a big D to deal with. I mean, Pichu just can kind of be so explosive, get those offstage kills, right? But at the same token, like you have the damage output that comes out of ICs and that kind of like range. Um, they have little like nuanced like ledge traps too. And when you have the character like Pichu that's so light, you probably die extremely early from these characters. So I'm <laughs> interesting to see what happens here. <laughs> Uh, me too, because I'm like, yeah, I, I know, like, the up air will definitely kill, you know? So it's like, yeah. and you know, Ice Climbers have, like, plenty of conversions into that movie. And it's just quick. Like, it's kind of hard. Oh, oh, there goes Nana. I see you. Ooh. Oh, no, he was able to save her. Hold on. Still dead? I don't know if that was worth it. Oh, Big D didn't actually kill him for it, though. So that might be worth it for Boy. Gets a little bit of extra damage on the Nana. Getting pushed off to the side here. Unity, will it come out on top? <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, that's great though. But like, so so here's a, something we haven't really like talked about yet today, I guess, um, which is an interesting point. And I, there's you know, of course, multiple sides to it, like there is for anything. But as of late, uh, kind of one of the more popular, uh, I guess, calls to action 
has been to defund the police, right? Um, and some people are, are super for it. Some people are super against it. Um, I feel like a lot of people don't understand what that call is. Yes, like, I think I, they they, yes. they hear that and they go like, oh, they want to get rid of all police. And I think we should probably like clear that up for anyone in chat who doesn't understand what the call is. I, I agree. Um, and definitely like I, I feel like you'd be great speaking on that. I just want to say a really quick thing before you get into it. Like people, please make sure as well as like pushing these things out and saying Black Lives Matter. If you're tweeting about these things, if you're putting information out there, please be sure to go ahead and push out solutions as well. There's a lot of great, solid, valuable solutions we can use to better ourselves and educate ourselves and help people. Let's spread that. Uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, the progressive movement has a huge tendency to be terrible in some of the worrying that they use to spread these um, causes. Mm -hmm. And they get eaten up all the time by conservative media. And that's just the truth. Like, there's sometimes some things they're just like terrible, terrible, terrible. He so, like, that. Be better than that. yo, what the heck was that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, can I literally get? Can, wait, can I literally just get like a? Can I get a replay? Like, it may, <laughs> you have replay move. Like, <laughs> can I get something that that was wild? What the that heck? Sucks. I don't. I, I was like, I, I'm sitting here. I'm like, oh yeah, defund the police, yada yada oh, yada. Clip, I'm like, thank that, you. Oh, I'm watch this clip. This is that was wild. <laughs> Man, <laughs> that was some fight, KGGP. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. If it star KO'd void with a one, yeah, that's a mood. That's wild. That was so wild. But yeah, I guess like, oh, defund the police, right? I mean, I guess it might change slightly depending on who, who you ask, but kind of the base idea is, I don't know if you guys in the chat are familiar with just like how much money police get for like an annual budget or like how much, how much they get allotted to their budget just for overtime. That is like incredibly sus. But it's just like, police don't need that much money. <laughs> they, they, they don't. Yeah, um, yeah. And, and, I mean, yeah. <laughs> they talk about it. Yeah, it, 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 yeah. It's, it's actually wild. It's usually when you look at the budget, um, and this is including education and all these kind of things, and like, it's like schools and like, and everything like that, like in the local governments, like usually it's like they're eating up like two thirds of the budget. Like, it's insane. Like, uh, some officers out here in San Jose, there was one officer, uh, they caught him on a uh, video and they had a Twitter clip of this guy and he was just happy to have uh, uh, a gun, like, with rubber bullets. And he was posing, like, he was playing COD and, like, he thought it was sick. And, like, he was just, like, laughing at people. He was like, oh, yeah, you can get shot now, doing all this wild stuff. And then they go ahead and look up at this guy's salary, $250,000. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Two hundred and fifty thousand dollars for officer. Wait. <laughs> whoa, whoa, wait. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the fifteen dollars, Tosh. What? I okay. We take All those, right. I guess. <laughs> I he just he literally exploded. He literally just got sent to the Sheldon room. Oh my gosh. I mean, I know I was talking about before that like <laughs> I feel like <laughs> that character can like trap him and then like Pichu will explode, but Pichu actually exploded like just literally disappeared from existence. I feel like I heard ready, set, go game. I know, right? That's, that's literally what I heard. Okay. <laughs> you you got it. Dang. <laughs> Freaking big D, man. He's, he's actually too good. 
But yeah, uh, going to where you're saying, like, they're getting these insane, insane yeah, games. bro. Um, like, you have teachers out here struggling, right? You Gotta have buy their own chalk. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. Like, you have them struggling, right? You talk about, um, for example, even like, like pharmacists, right? 